All right, everybody, welcome to Planet Pool Tour. We're going to do a match with Ryan McCreesh and Sean Wilkie. I'll be joined by Matt Craw and Mike Riccadella here in the booth. Matt, how are you, sir? Good, how are you? Good. Uh, tell us about your last match. Um, played pretty well. I made a few mistakes. Uh, I was breaking the balls a lot better than I was last night on that table, so I, it helped. I was pretty much breaking the ball and getting a shot a lot, so I took advantage of what I had, and uh, he made some mistakes and took over. Semi-final match, just getting started. Ryan McCreesh. Sean Wilkie. Winner meets... Who does the winner meet in the final? Me. Oh, me! <laughs> M-E. Macra. Macra. No kidding. How do you spell that? K-R-E... Uh, K-R-A-H. K-R-A-H. Macra. <laughs> Waiting for the winner of this match for the final. The final will be a two-set. Finally, they had, the winner here had to beat Matt twice, so they'll play a race to nine in the final. And if Matt wins that, it's over. If he loses, they'll have to play a second race, race to seven. But right now, we're going to watch to see who's going to uh, meet Matt in the final. This is semi-final match on the loser side, so it's semi-final. It's a race to seven. That was a pretty good match you had against Ryan there a minute ago. Was yeah. Nine to four. Nine to four. Yeah. He was um he made some mistakes I took advantage of and then kinda I played good at points and made a few mistakes myself, but I didn't really get punished for him luckily. No, not at nine to four. Yeah. <laughs> no, you turned out pretty nice. Ryan doesn't usually get beat that decisively. <laughs> yeah, he's he's beat me the last couple of times we played, so I felt good to finally uh take him down a match. Well, you got to feel good about beating him like that. Yeah. Maybe, especially if you see him again. You'll be, you'll, you'll be in his mind. You'll be thinking about that 9-4. to four. We got some emails coming in. People asking some questions. If we see anything good, we'll answer them. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just pick and choose the ones we like. Yeah, looks but I like can't a... see that for us. So I'm going to depend on your eyes, big boy. I mean, Unless you... you this first game looks like it's going to go to Ryan. Yeah, he's in pretty good though. shape here. He should be going up one nothing here, right? So. It's race to seven on the loser side, so it's a little. These first couple games are real important in the short race. He's not happy with his leave here. It's going to work out fine, I'm sure, but he's just going to have to work it. He 
shouldn't have any problem with this. This should be a... Yeah. Ryan does You don't make that many mistakes. No, no, no. Problem with you was... You didn't give him any no. chance to make mistakes. So I just noticed <laughs> Jose's walking over to Ryan because uh, you have to have a collared shirt on to play on that table. And Ryan took his shirt off. So, oh, he uh, took it off, yeah. Well, so Jose's uh, making him put it back on there. Yeah, Ryan knows this. <laughs> White does something like that. He knows this. Well, we'll just leave it at that. He, uh, everybody knows you got to have a collar on the TV table. All right, let's see what he can do with his break. How's that table breaking earlier? Is it breaking all right? Um, I made I made balls on it. I I didn't last night. I was kind of breaking, uh, but between the the diamond and the side rail, and I wasn't making a ball. And today I uh, moved it over almost like just barely off the side rail and cut it a little more. And I was making the one uh, two rails, and I was I was making balls. But okay. um. I watched uh, Sean play on here earlier against Alaska, and they weren't breaking too well either. They were kind of breaking towards the the middle of the table, and it wasn't breaking too well. So uh, we'll see. Ryan Ryan came up dry against me a lot yeah, the last okay. match. Yeah, he was. Yeah, right there is where I broke from last night. I wasn't having too much luck. I moved it over a little more, but let's see what happens here. He's up to you. No, it looks like he's dry again. Yeah. Sure. I'm not sure if it's because all the all the lights on the table, you know, it's it's playing Slow a little down. different. Yeah, the, the the break it. Well, you get the lights, you get the heat. Yeah, everything's a little. I played on the I sound. Played on this There's table no uh, a few weeks ago at a tournament here, and it, it the what these the lighting wasn't as good, and uh, the uh, played totally different. So now it's kind of <laughs> yeah. It's a, well, you got different atmosphere. Yeah, too, so you got to get adjusted. And, and the tables out here play in the other room play a lot different than this table. So players are coming back and forth. It takes some a few games to kind of get used to the speed on this table. Right. Mm. Yeah, take ball in hand. I think Sean's out from here. If I'm well, it depends how he gets from the uh, the two to the three. The um, the twos. He's gonna have to hit, touch, hit the nine. And it's kind of well, came from there. He's gonna, well, yeah, if he wasn't there, he could have come off the side back rail, I mean, three rail, but he can't there. He might have to do the same thing here. He might have to use inside. You think? I think he's gonna have. Well, he may have to go rail first. Make the ball. I don't think he can three go rail first no. where he's at. No, probably scratch. He's got to. Let's see what he does. Yeah, he did hit it. You're right. Yeah. It worked out good. He got away with it. Well, the only problem is he put the five in trouble. Now he's now he's stuck on the, the five stuck. Sometimes we look. Sitting here with Matt Crawl. He's helping us announce his semifinal match. He's waiting for the winner of this to play in the final. I'm Mike Riccadella from Planet Pool. And we're looking at game two of the semifinal, race of seven. I want to take an opportunity to thank the Planet Pool sponsors that we have on tour that help sponsor these events. I want to thank Remax and Pete Boyer of Coins of the Realm, George Hammerbacher, our BC instructor, Capone Cues. Jab Productions, The Mez Tour, Jose Borges, Gambling Clothing Company. I want to thank Mike and Carl here at Top Hat Q in Parkville for putting this event on for us. This is the second of three that they're going to do for us in 2011. They do a nice job here. Get the, get the tables in great shape. Conditions are good. It's a good shot. Everybody likes playing here. That was a great shot. Yeah, I didn't know what he was going to come with there. He hit it real good. Yeah. It's a big game, too, you know. He's, oh, yeah. You don't want to get out 2 nothing in a race to yeah. 7. Oh, well, he's going to. Uh-oh. Put the, the hex on him. <laughs> Ouch. 
wonder how Ryan likes the table now. <laughs> yeah. I give a little plug to uh, Big uh, uh, Big Daddies next weekend. They're going to have the Maryland State Straight Pool Championship out of Big Daddies in Glen Burnie, Maryland. That's Rick and Cindy Molinero to put that on next weekend. I think they have 30 about 30 players already registered. They get room for a few more. So if you're interested, you ought to give them a call. Well, Ryan just you came. You playing on. in that straight pool next weekend? Um, no, I'm playing in a mes event in uh, Pennsylvania. Well, that's right, mes event next weekend. Yeah, pretty Pennsylvania. close to my house, about 25 minutes away. So I'm. What part go to of Pennsylvania that. is that? You know? Uh, Fraser, PA. Fraser, PA. Yeah. There's a mes mes event next weekend. You'll see Matt Crawl there. He probably will be the winner of this event, maybe, huh? <laughs> we'll see. <Yeah. laughs> Uh oh! When uh, he hit that, oh, that was not a good hit. Yeah. I think he jumped up on that. It looks like the uh, the same eight ball he missed on me the last rack there. Did he jump up or something? Yeah. He did. Left Sean pretty good too. I should yeah, be. Left him real good. I mean, Sean's out. Should be. Yeah. And let's see where are we at. Planet Pools next event will be down at uh, Triple Nines in uh, Elk Ridge, Maryland. That's Triple Nine, Elk Ridge, Maryland, uh, August sixth, seventh. It'll be a $2,000 added event, just like this one. 1000 added for the Open and 1000 added for the ladies' event. You ought to come out there and check us out down there. That'll be the first time we play at uh, a plan a pool event down there. Sean ended up uh, in that weird spot. I ended up a couple times on the nine right there where he... <laughs> seemed to table, you expect yeah, yeah. it. The, it's go, it plays a little faster, like I said, than the other tables out here. Uh-oh. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my Ooh. goodness. Wow. That ain't working. Left that him, ain't working. Left him long, That's the left, way you do it. <laughs> he left him. He left it, uh, the eight hanging in the hole. Yeah, well, so Ryan's out, he's, out, he's out like a light here. If he get come, as long as he comes down far enough towards the middle of the table for the nine. Oh, he'll be fine. That spot Sean was just in on that ball. I got on that ball twice like that. It's seems to be coming a little long. And oh, he'll be fine. Huh? Yeah, he hit, that, he hit that perfect. Yeah, he don't make this any. Yeah, it looks like it's going to go to 2-0. Two 2-0. Nothing. Two nothing. Two nothing, Ryan. You might have got him a little upset by beating him the way you did. <laughs> You're going to get out there and get the job done fast. <laughs> no, he's got his work cut out. These two guys play. They battle all the time. They must have played each other a lot of times. They had a great match years. earlier when Hill Hill. Yeah, that's when Hill Hill, first too. time they played on the uh, in the semifinals. In that hill, that, they the were nervous side. on that hill hill game too, because there was a lot of mistakes in that. Yeah, that final yeah. Game. Sean missed the uh, the two and um, yeah. the four, and Ryan made a real good out from there. He went and broke a couple balls out, and Sean was up like six two in that match, and uh, yes, he, he, he missed a nine ball to pretty much bury it, and then Ryan came back and got a lot of momentum and played real well, and then he moved the ball out a little further. Yeah, he's trying Let's that. See if, that break now he's going off to the, the rail, uh, the back the, rail, the back rail. Yep. He's got to do something because whatever he's doing ain't working. That worked. There you go. He, he got a two first. ball, I think, didn't he? You know, he, he, got he does that break a lot, ball. and he has a lot of success with it. Uh, I watched him at Turningstone uh, one time use that break, and he did a real <laughs> off that back rail. Well, sometimes you just got to keep moving around until yeah, you find the spot. Yeah. Right now, I think he's looking at that nine ball, but I don't think so. Um, no, I wouldn't be surprised if he played. He, he played here and put the cue play behind safe. the three. I think, yeah, right. yeah, I think sure. I'd go for it. Well, he played safe. Uh, he didn't. He set it up for a combo. Yeah. But it didn't. That's a good move. He's yeah, still got a ball. He'll probably get ball out of this. The speed. He's having some problems with the speed on this table, yeah. it seems like. And, you know, you play that combo and you don't, you don't, you lose that cue ball a little bit. Yep. Next thing you know, you hang that one the combo guy out. and, yeah. Yeah, you give him a gimme. He put in a good spot, too. Good Sean, uh, Sean really doesn't have a good uh, kick here because no. the, eight, the eight blocks the two rail. He's got to do it. Look, he's got to just clip it. He might kick, hit the one and make the nine here if he ain't. If, if, he, if he hits the one, he's got a good chance he's of He's going to hit. If he hits the one, he'll make contact with the nine. But Yeah. And I'll tell you what, it looks like if he hits it right, the angle is... <laughs> I wouldn't. I would. I wouldn't. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be surprised that nine ball gets real close to the hole if he makes contact. This is a real tough. If pick. not, I, I don't think Ryan strong to just combo. hit this ball. If he can hit this, it's a. It's a oh yeah. Well, actually, it's probably one rail. 
can he see one rail? I can't yeah. tell from where oh, I'm I don't know. You know He what? can see I don't one know. rail until early. I thought he had to go two, I'm looking at. I think he might be able to. I don't know. If you he can go right. one, he definitely he has might be a, able to go one. I don't know. a better chance of hitting it. Let's see. We can tell. Bad hit. It was a bad hit? Yeah. I didn't see it. Yep. Well, it runs out from here, I think, no matter what he does. He's not going to play the combo. No. No, he won't play the combo here. I don't even know. <laughs> yeah. He looks like he might be playing it. I don't think he would. He is. Oh, Look he's at that. He's playing the combo. I no, guess he likes I think it. he's playing the one in the corner. Yeah, he ain't playing the combo. That's too far away. It's, it's, it's almost a diamond it's, away. You gotta try to, I think you got to try to run out from here. This table is wide it's open. It's wide open. There's no reason not to run these. Yeah, he's playing it. Yeah. He, he very rarely goes for They're all in the hole. Hit that good. Yep. Get a little sporty now. Get a little reckless, you start going bass backwards on them. Bending over the wrong way. This is about like a 95%. He's out. He's going to go up 3 nothing in a race of 7. That's tough. Yeah. But the only good thing is, though, it's winter breaks. So, I mean, you're capable. Sean's capable of putting packs together, too. Oh, yeah. it, the winter breaks makes it a little better. I mean, because, you know, you get a 3 nothing alternate and break. Yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Big yeah. underdog. But um, oh, yeah. in a race, you know, winter breaks race to 7. Well, who does the alternate and break these days? What tours do that? Uh, the Mez Tour does the it. Mez a lot, a lot, yeah. Um, the uh, Pro Tour don't do that on the regular events, the major events. No, um, no. Well, some, some. Some do. Um, the majors? Yeah. Summer alternate and summer winter. Most of the 10 ball events are winter breaks. Some, most of the 9 well, ball are still alternate. Yeah. You, yeah. you know, you don't string racks with yeah. 10 like you. I kind of got on the. Uh, we got a little out of line here, but not the yard line he's fine, here. He's fine, but he's he's still a little out of line. You just got to you got to he's got to spin it into the side and spin it in. draw it over a little. I mean, it's fine. He's going to yeah. have automatic easy shape, but there's room for a little error. Here. He could make a mistake, but I don't think so. He's got jack up. Or he wants to jack up. He doesn't really need to, but. Yep, perfect. Yep. So, don't see any problems here. Nope, this is it. Let's see if he can... Uh... Keep it going. Hard to find a room last night, huh? Yeah. Stay in. You guys end up on Yeah, we, we drove about a half hour away. Um, yeah, everything was booked up around here. Did you go north or south? Uh, s north, yeah. North. We were near, right near Baltimore. Okay. Yeah, they had some major thing here in Parkville. They had some tournament or something. Yeah. Right? Some... Yeah. yeah. I didn't think we'd have any problem in the hotel. Yeah, bam, bam, bam. They can't get nothing nowhere. Let's see if he, I bet he does the same break again, of course, because it worked. Stay with it. He's got that long, sort of a long, yeah. a long gap here. He likes yeah, that. If he's making gap. a break here, he'll, I think he'll use this break the rest of the tournament. Oh, yeah. He, yeah, you know he's gonna, he didn't make a ball against me on the break, and well, that was he made one last time. Let's yeah, see if he can make one or two here. He's hitting him soft too. You know, he's not Nothing. hitting him a lot. He's kind of slow breaking. He's dry on, on this. He's dry, too. Yeah. Got away with that one though. Yeah, yeah. That five nine five. is that's game over. Whoever touches that five. <coughs> and Sean's in a bad spot here because he's got to push, and the where the one is. Yeah, we'll push out. He'll make it so he jumps it. He'll set up for a jump. Set up. Yep. 
He said, I ain't. No, I'm, I'm going to push out to a jump. Yeah. If I'm, uh, I'd let him shoot if I'm Ryan, I get, or Sean, yeah. Ryan, you got to give this to him. Because even if he jumps it in and makes it, he's not going to get no way to get on that, too. There's no position. And there's no way. You might leave yourself it's, safe. He's not going to make the, uh, the, fat, the nine from here, either. Well, he might play a jump safe instead of jump make. You know? One yeah. rail, bring the well, that's probably, yeah. Don't try to make it, try to play safe. I mean... I, I I play the percentage and give this to my opponent. If they hit it good, then you know, good shot to them. They deserve it. Yeah, well, you know, uh, if he hits it real good, he could go around the I table mean, if and he get up here. If he hangs this or leaves you know, Ryan a shot at all, that's... he might go around the table. See that? Oh, he didn't uh, yeah, see that's. I mean, you can make that ball, but then you know, you know he's kicking. I was saying he had to hit it twice as hard to come around the table, but he didn't hit it hard enough. Left himself safe, like we were saying. Yeah. What looked like a pretty jump shot ends up being a safety on yourself. Not so pretty, they call it. <laughs> Alvin, that's one of them not-sos. Not so pretty. It's like when you push out and try to play safe and leave the guy out. That's a not-so-safe. <laughs> what are they asking on the stream? I saw somebody just ask me a question. I... He's going to have a little difficult time. Oh, is He's that Raphael? Go hey, what's up, Raph? to um, Yeah, I'm going to be a mainline for sure, dude. I hear Pat Benatar on the music in the background here. I just saw her the other night, Friday night in Baltimore. Is it? Six. Man, she's an unbelievable. 57 years old and she cranks it, baby. Unbelievable. <laughs> Pat Benatar and sticks, sticks open for her. Oh, yeah? Sticks wow. Sticks open. Right in downtown Baltimore. About 15 minutes from here. You're a nutso, Mikey. Oh, I'm a nutso. Who said that? You're talking to me. Oh. Hey. All right, Raph, man. Yeah, so I might like stop up Tuesday night in Drexel Island, so I'll see you up there. That's Road Doggy Stevie. Okay, Road Doggy. <laughs> I hear you. Jungle Shot I'll show said, you how nuts I am next time Pat. I see you, big boy. <laughs> Jungle Shot just said, hit me with your best shot. Triple shot. <laughs> I give you my best one. <laughs> Fire away. That's what he just did, but it didn't work. Yeah, uh, that's... Yeah, that wasn't your best shot, Sean. That uh, that could be 4 nothing real it quick four now. It is 4 because it got 1-5. Yeah, if, if he gets on... Turn out the lights. This game's over. They're going to put him... What, if he makes this combo, where's he going to be? On ease. Easy He's on ease. Easy Street. We had it going yesterday with the chorus. Me and, me and Elvin, we were singing Easy Street. We might be able to get a, a threesome here. Three of us. If we can all get into the right key. I don't sing, so. You don't sing, you can go ee. You guys start singing, like, I'm out of here. Well, then just, you just be quiet. Foes <laughs> <laughs> it. Hey, man. Are you going to Salisbury next month? Um, I think so. That's a test dummy, 69. Uh, he thinks he's going. I think so. I'm, uh, I have to look at, um, there's actually... I might be going to a concert in New York. I promised the girlfriend that I would take her to a, uh, a concert at, um, at the Meadowlands. So uh, if I still end up, I might be obligated that weekend. I might be obligated that weekend. Yeah. So I, I don't know yet. We're still the deciding. Band you want to uh, it's a country. Uh, Zach Brown band and Kenny Chesney. I'm, I'm not a big country music guy, but she is. So. But um, if not, I'll definitely. Is that the girlfriend you have with you this weekend, or is that? Yeah. Kidding, <laughs> kidding. You've been with the same girl for quite a while. Yeah. What a year and a half. Two? Yeah, a year and a half. A year and a half. She's a sweetheart. Yeah, she's a nice girl. I take her to that country show. <laughs> I'll tell you what I'll do. You go to Salisbury. I'll take her to the country show, <laughs> and I'll bring her back in one piece next day. <laughs> all right. If you if she's down with that. See, yeah. she's all right with it. Yeah, you know I. I you know you can trust me. Yeah. I'd, right, Elvin? You can trust me. I'm very trustworthy. I'd pick a pool tournament over a concert Somebody here says, Jungle Shot says, take her to Carnegie Hall. There's a pool room across the street. Oh, yeah? So you can park her, get her some popcorn, <laughs> go across the street. I hear in the background, you're not going to Salisbury by yourself. <laughs> Desiree says, ain't no way. Desiree says, ain't no way. <laughs> well, you don't want to go by himself. It's lonely on the road. You got to bring your girl with you. 
If she wants to skip the concert, we can go there together for sure. Yeah, definitely. I'm playing in that. Uh, outstanding. You'd love that. Show. Yeah. It's I mean, really I, I got the. I'm playing in that Seminole event at, Rhode, at Snookers in Rhode Island. That big twenty-five thousand added tournament the weekend before. So, yep. I might take the take the next weekend off anyway. I don't know. That that action tour. I won the first event, so I'm tied as the points leader. So I'd, I kind of want to go to Salisbury because the winner of that tour gets the after the events gets a U.S. Open spot. So that saves a little money, but. You know, if you want it, if you wait, yeah. So I get. Well, you bang it on one. Yeah. If she wants to go to the concert in New York, I think maybe you need to go. There. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that would make her happy for a while, wouldn't it? You think she'd be happy for a month or two? <laughs> if you go to New York, <laughs> stop. I'm helping you out. I'm on your side, Desiree. She is beautiful. All right. Let's see. She's a doll. Oh, look at somebody on, online says Desiree is a doll. Don't blow it. <laughs> Better bring the three piece. That's right. It's a P -P -P That's my friend Raphael from Juxilla. Okay, score. Somebody on the online is telling us to keep score here because we're not doing. It. It's four to four. Oh, excuse me, four to nothing, Ryan. Yeah. But I do believe we have the score on the screen too, don't we? When it, the viewers are seeing the score too. It's cool. So just so you don't, we do have a score online there too, guys, so you can see it. Because we usually make mistakes here, and sometimes we'll tell you what the score is, and it might not be right. Me and Alvin have been known to do that quite a bit. Go into story time. And it's, the sad thing is we used to have to put the score up ourselves, but we don't do that, do we? We do? We're still doing mm. Somebody said you slipped in the points because you missed the last event. <laughs> Fred is in the lead. Is he? Brett's in the lead is what they say. Yeah, actually, yeah, that's probably right because he had a good finish in both of them. Yeah. Can you just pay the entry fee and not show up and get the points? <laughs> you can get points for entering. Yeah. We do that here at Planet Pool. You can make the pay the entry fee and not show, and you'll get points for the minimum points. Mike Davis used to do it all the time. Did he? When he was a leader and couldn't make a tournament. Oh, yeah? He'd pay the entry fee and not show, and just get the uh, minimum point thing. That's a good idea. Nothing wrong with that. Yeah. Yeah. Us, we don't mind. I should have. If all hundred players would do that, yeah. I'm sure I wouldn't have to do the event. I could stay home and make money. Well, I um. I, That'd be all right. Hey, Ryan, just, it's a good shot. Uh -oh. Sean hit. Sorry, Ryan. Like Sean hit. Yeah, it's a real good shot. You think uh, Sean can come back for another and race us up? Yeah, uh, yeah, he can. I've seen him do it. Ryan was down. Ryan was down six two the first time they played and came back and beat him in nine. So I mean, he was down four games and came back. But you know, I'm watching this match. Sean hadn't really been to the table. No, much. Sean's got it, but you know, he has a good chance here to, good chance here to get ball in hand yeah. or at least get yeah, a shot. Yeah, he should get this game. He's he got to win this game. You know, you know, you're down five nothing. You're in trouble. But if he gets this, make this hit. if he gets this game, uh, he's back in. I'll tell you what, I had that uh, shrimp macaroni again today, but it's good. I had that yesterday and I thought it was good. Today, I think it's better. Yeah. Right, let's see if he can make the... Oh, I think he's going to make the hit. Look at that. Wow. And look at the leave. Great hit, but uh, yeah, yeah, that, from that spot, you know, you you gotta hit it hard. Like, I mean, you gotta get get a break. Well, that 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 uh, shrimp pasta is is a uh, it's shrimp pasta, not macaroni. Shrimp pasta, and it's homemade by by Mike, the owner's wife. Her name Joy. She makes it homemade. It's dynamite. We gotta give a bunch of bucks to that mac uh, that uh, pasta salad. All the food here is pretty good. I mean, the menu's small, but everything's good. Although I did—I I don't know about that pizza. I—I I, I didn't try the pizza. So if you're thinking about coming out and watching the final, they got some pretty good food here. Come on over. There's plenty of room. We got lots of seats. Final over here at uh, Top Hat, Parkville, just outside of Baltimore. The final should be starting. This is semi-final. The final will be going on in probably within the hour. So you still got time to get here. 
Kenny Chesney. Didn't he the guy that sings like a one for one pina colada? Or is that the other guy? <laughs> oh, no shoes, no shirt, no problem. That's Kenny Chesney, isn't it? No shoes, no shirt, no problem. Is it close to 95? Yeah, uh, 95. It was 695. Parkville, this room is just off 695. Maybe five minutes off 695. I think it's Route 41. Somebody said five miles. Yeah, it's only That's that Dan, Dan Mershrak. Dan, Don, Dan, Dandy Don Mershrak. Uh-oh, here we go. Four to one. There's plenty of parking. There's food. Good-looking women. Oh, excuse me. Good-looking guys and girls. Good food. Here we go. Four to one. Oh, I know. Oh, I know. Yeah. It's not 24 hours here anymore. It used to be, or it used to be a long time ago, I think, right? Yeah. Man, we, you guys, we got three guys in the booth here doing this commentary. We got Elvin, Matt Crawl, Mike Riccadella. We got coverage. This is what you call full coverage. <laughs> I'm not going to go into detail about all that that. Let's see where he's breaking. He's breaking on the other side of the table, closer to the rail. Uh, so he's breaking. He hasn't been. He hasn't broken in a while. That's, That's where, I, break, where he's breaking now is where I usually break when I play yeah. nine ball. I usually I usually break pretty good from there. But um, That's a better place to break. Look, yeah, he made see, three I wasn't balls. Making, made I tried that break balls. a few times this week and I haven't been making anything. He made three balls and the yeah. queue. Well, the one didn't go. So he made two balls in the queue. Left him out. I think, I think, look at I these, it's wide open. I can't tell that. that it's two ball. That two, yeah, is that two go by that six into the side over there? He's going to have to probably, yeah. That does? If, yeah, then he should be fine. It does? Yeah. Oh, yeah, it goes, yeah, I think it does. Okay. Okay. It does, it it does not go, go past. They're saying it doesn't go past. We had to send somebody out on foot to go check it out yeah, to see the angle, and they come back and said it doesn't go. So he's going to have to play it somewhere else. Yeah, he's got to play the combo, or he's got to play the two here down here. He looks like the combo. Sound, yeah, he's playing for the combo. Yeah. He's got to do the combo. Now he's got to make sure he lays it up right for the two ball shot. Going to play it down the long rail. Uh oh. That's not where he wanted to be. Oh, that, yeah, that's not good. He messed it up. He hit it too hard. Huh? Yeah, he should have gone fatter into it. Left it further up the rail. No, you can't. He left himself with no room of error. You don't have a shot here without scratching. No. I mean, he's got to play safe. He's got no choice. You have to play safe. Oh, he's going to come off the back rail and kick it in? No. He's going to play safe because uh, if he misses, Sean's out. You can't afford to. Can't afford nothing. That's the move. It's the only move you could do. Yeah, that was a good shot. Yeah, that's all he could do. I think Sean's gonna um try to he try to bank safe. it and put the cue. He might put the cue behind the nine. Yeah, he's, yeah, try, he's try to bank the two behind the five around there. I'll try to hide it somewhere. This is a very important game for Sean because he can't go down 5-1 in a race of seven and, and think he's ever going to get on easy street. It's real hard. And here's a touch shot. You know, you're on a scratch. What do you do here? He's got to go the other way. They were asking, they they were asking will, will every plan of pool be live streamed? I don't, not every one of them, I don't think, right? The last well, one wasn't, was it? No. We've done two live streams out of four tournaments. We did Champions in Frederick and we did this one. So probably half of our events will be live streamed professionally by Inside Pool. That's the way to do a stream is professionally. If you do it the other way, these guys do it. it the viewing is not that great. We've seen that. We've seen the quality. If you guys notice the quality now, it's like what I'm hearing from everybody watching online at home, it's crystal clear. It's incredible. The quality coming across their screen is incredible. I would hate to do it any other way. Yeah, that's a good shot. That's a shot I like playing right there. It's perfect. I mean, give yourself two chances to put you behind the nine or the five. 
Look at that. Test dummy says, Mike, great job commentating. Did you guys get one of those too? <laughs> 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 Got to shoot away. Yeah. Oh, thank you, uh, test dummy. I like coming into this ball with some speed. I'm appreciated somewhere. Now I got to find out if test dummy is a guy or a uh. girl, Elvin. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Yeah, Chances are it's a woman, right? Yeah. We well, you familiar with that online stuff. Uh, I agree with Mike for inside pull stream. I watched action last week, one of the viewers said, and it was not as good. <laughs> Test dummy said sorry, guy. Oh I'll test dummy, that's okay. <laughs> You, uh, well, you might know you were, somebody. You, were you, see, you might know some gal. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You might know some good-looking woman. You're not, you're you know. not that lucky, man. Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> sorry, guy. Sorry, guy. Well, I didn't say that person was a guy. I just said sorry, guy. Like, hi, guy. I Thanks, dudes. Yeah. Who's uh, world? Oh, is that you? I got a commentator from the commentator. We got a comment from the commentator. <laughs> At least he ain't singing. You ought to hear this guy sing over there. Unbelievable. And he won't practice. Yeah. I think that you're, you're, you're getting it. You're getting it. He's on. Let's see who wins this. Oh, no, this is going to make it 4-2. to two. This is key for Sean. If he, if he don't win this, he's in trouble. And he just went almost too far. He hit that perfect. Yeah, it's perfect. So we got a four. looks like 4-2 to two, almost guaranteed. Race to 7. Uh, you know, if he can break a run out, we got a ball game. We're gonna see a barn burner. Burner on the barn? I would I wouldn't have gone that far over there. Yeah, he went a little far, but he's all right. Yeah. Yeah, but you know, he don't miss much. I think he'll be all right. He's, I'm sure he's all right. I'd bet the house he makes that. Yeah. yeah Although my house is totally mortgaged, so I wouldn't be losing anything <laughs> <laughs> if I lost the bet. He'll take his time now because he can't afford to make a boo-boo here. There it is. Four to two. Now, if he can break without scratching like he did last time, he's out. This game, he two, three balls on the this break. game right here might be the match breaker. You know, I think you're right. Four to three or five to two. That's, that's right. huge. So this is... Sean if wins I was this a game. Momentum yeah. swings right back into him big time. If I was a bet man, betting was legal. I'd bet that he breaks and runs on this because he <laughs> made three, almost three balls last time and scratched. I'm betting he's out. I got a feeling he's going to break and run because he's been tired of sitting. He has been sitting quite a bit. Yeah. You know, he needs to stay. He wants to stay <laughs> up. And I, bad bet, he says. Somebody said pro pool player said so that's a bad bet. Sell everything. Bad bet. Everybody's telling me it's a bad bet. My hero. Tough shape. You know that he breaks and runs, betting on that? Brian doesn't play as good when he's quiet. Lots of laughs. He got a raft out. That's true. He's got to be yelling and screaming and complaining to be. He's like Strickland. They got to be talking and yelling and screaming. Complaining about the table, the heat, the da 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 da. da. I can hear oh. I better whisper because Ryan can hear what you're saying. Ooh. He's used to me. All right. I'm oh, glad. Man, you would have uh, just went bust there. I would have gone bust. <laughs> Look at that. You're right. Who told me the bad bet? Cut pro him. pool player told me. You're right, pro pool player. Look, he left, he left Ryan out, too. I think he's, straight I think in he's on the hooked. One. Can he see it? I think he can make that. If he can see it, he's got to... Can he make the one? Oh, he's got to jump it. Well, I it, think he can spin it now. He's got to spin it, but then look, look where the two is. I know. The one, and the two's in a very difficult spot. Especially from there. Oh, that's a good shot. He hit it great. I mean, that's not a good shot. That's a great shot. That really is a very good shot. You just gotta make sure you uh, you miss the point here. Yep. Just I always kinda... catch them points. You know, I love points, but when I catch these points, I'm not really happy about it. <laughs> I see some guys go in there and bend them points in occasionally. There's no. Is there a rule on that? You know? I don't know. Look at that. Yeah, see, see that? that? Yeah. What? Yeah. He jumped up or something. He got away with it. He made it. Oh. He 
he'll never admit that he got a roll there. He will never admit he got a roll there. He'll say the table played bad. That's why he missed it. <laughs> anyway, but he's got perfect shape, right? Is he in, shooting a four? Yes. Did Brett play this weekend? Yeah, Brett played. He got, uh, what did he get, fifth, sixth, or seventh, eighth? Yep, yeah, yeah. Seventh, eighth. Yeah, Brett made it today, and um, uh, Alaska knocked him out. Yeah, Brett got seventh through eighth. Yeah, Brett lost his first match, I think, to Ryan. First or second match, and then he came back pretty good, grinded all day, and he ended up getting knocked out by Alaska this morning. got there. Just got there. That's real close. He might have to spin this in a little bit, but I, he should, I think he can make it. And he don't look too, uh, too mad, so I think he's alright. Just make this in a natural shape. Yeah. Good to go. Everything's pretty tic tac toe. The only um, seven to the eight. Just want to make sure you get good on the eight. Yeah, he went far. Came long. Everybody's coming long to that bottom rail. Yeah, I'd, I would have just kind of stayed in the middle there. I don't, he tried to get too perfect on it. Got away with it. He had a good, real good shot right there. Great recovery. All right, where are we at here? Ooh, five to two. What's, what's Ryan talking to? Is it too loud? I think he says there's a little background noise. He wants uh, Kevin West to be quiet. Kevin West has got to keep it down over there, West. He's used to being in that chicken coops where the noise is so loud, he's got to talk loud over yeah, those Ryan, chickens when it chicken. Ryan just ended up there, too. He's all right, though. He didn't... He, he but he didn't. knows chickens. Kevin West knows chickens. Right, Kevin? This should be an automatic. Ryan jumped up again on that. He got a little nervous. But he made it. Test we got a 5-2. to two. Test, I wouldn't quite say it's easy street, but it's uh, semi-easy street. Yeah, Wilkie would definitely better get on his horse. This he is, gotta, yeah, he does. He this is the this game. game. You've got to win this game, game or it's yeah. good night, Irene. Yeah, I, right? I definitely have to go against him from here. Because what we're playing for here, this is second and third, right? Second place is 500, third place is 300. Jump so there's a couple hundred score on here. Gold. And then the Calcutta that factors in a little bit too. Second and third. Not much difference in the Calcutta. But a shot at uh, the final table against you. First prize is 900. Second prize is 500. Loser here gets 300. On the women's, on the women's side, we had a small field of women. We only had seven, eight women. But they had a nice added... Pool, thousand dollar added on the women. The first place women is four hundred. Second place pays two hundred. Third place plays three hundred. Oh, he made a ball. He made he's two uh, balls. He made lots of balls. He's lots soft, of balls. He's soft breaking now, kind of. Two balls break, on the break, straight in the hole. It's working good. Is he straight in the hole? Yeah, he's he, out. He, he's out. For him. Well, I didn't see every break. How can we say that? There was a million breaks. Somebody made the nine on the break. That's better. Oh, on the TV tip. Okay. Thank you for clarification, Elvin. What are the pants again? I missed it. Oh, you want me to replay what I just said? No problemo. 
First place for the open event pays 900. Second place plays two. Third is 300. Fourth is 200. Second's 500. Kevin, Kevin Westcott, fourth, uh, fourth place two. is 200. Second place is 500. Yeah, you said 200. You well, said let, me, two. let me go back again. <laughs> Matt, Matt Crawl said I said it different wrong. First place is nine. Second is 500. Third is three. Fourth was Kevin West at 200. Fifth, sixth was 150. Sean Morgan, Alan Duty got fifth, sixth. Seventh, eighth went to Brett Stoudemire and Josh Brothers. And like I said, women's one, two, three is 400, 200, 100. Jose uh, Burgess came over and was trying to give me a little information to pass on. I was just talking about the Calcutta. Yeah, it's just six to two. Now, what do you, what do you call Sean's six to two? Uh, He's on. Get some he away from here. Easy Street. This is, gonna, this is Ryan's match to lose. Yes, now. You, it's the too early to say Easy Street. You think? Okay. Alvin in the booth says it's too early to say that Ryan's on Easy Street. It's six to two. Ryan needs one game. Matt. Uh, Sean needs a five pack. About what? I said Sean's uh, got to get some rolls probably to win from here. I said this is Ryan's match to lose. Ryan is a tough I mean, nut to crack. There's no doubt about it, I mean, especially when he's up 6 2. He's gonna, he'll probably get a few chances, you know, unless Sean plays absolutely flawless from here. Sean's gonna have to. It hit, almost doesn't matter. Sean's what gonna he have does. to hit him with a pack, you know, like a like a like a two or three pack to. Oh my God! Yeah. To get in it, I mean. It might be over right here. He might crack it and run out. If he hits him like he did last game. Yeah. If he, he watch, I, I think watch, he's, watch he's got momentum. He's, he's, he's coming off him. He's not hitting him too hard. He's just medium medium speed on him and. That last was a break and run. We haven't seen a, a, a ton of break and runs lately. Look at that! That ball fours in too. Two balls in. Hello. Straight in on the one. <laughs> Now I'm going to Easy Street. Ah, Easy Street. Ah, he's jacked up now. And that, he's and that. on Easy Street. <laughs> Hello. He's jacked up. With I think even Matt Crawl agrees with us here. He's jacked Don't up you, with, a, with a you half. You think he's on Easy Street or not? Not yet. Oh, stop it already. He's jacked up with a half a ball pocket here. Oh, he's making it look tough. He's a good showsman. No, it is a tough shot. But you can't you can't miss. It'll kiss the two and go in if you yeah, hit it bad. Might. Even if you hit it bad, just kissed it too. Oh, he, yeah. oh, he hit that real bad. That wasn't even close to being bad. That was a, that was awful. But that's all right. You know, he's got a 6-2 lead. He's feeling loose. Feeling loose. He's still on easy streak. Has he got a five-game, you know, five, uh, four-game lead? Tell you what. Uh, who plays the winner of this? Who? Do, you, hey, Matt Crawl. Who plays the winner of this match in the final? I do. I, I do hope, does. I, I hope Ryan doesn't. No, I uh, do's on second. I hope Ryan. Who's on first? I hope Ryan doesn't continue to uh, get that breakdown either. I could be in trouble in the finals. Matt Crawl's playing Ryan. Well, if Ryan wins in the final, if Ryan don't win, Matt Crawl still plays the final, but against somebody else. Be Sean Wilkie. One of these guys. Yeah, Wilkie's my. Matt Crawl's the answer. Wilkie's my old road partner. We used to travel everywhere, so we know each other's games real well. We sparred since we were kids. I played Ryan in a lot of tournaments too, so I'm pretty you guys familiar with these guys. Uh, jurisdiction or something? Um, Sean Saint lives Project. in Saint Project, I was in Newark, Delaware. It's only about 25 minutes drive, but so we grew up playing like junior tournaments together, and we um, used to come down to all my local tournaments in Newark, and I'd go to all his around his way, and we would just we were friends since we were kids. We used to Thank travel all, all the time. You guys about the same age? Uh, yeah, I'm 29. He's 30, so yeah, same age. Yeah. Perfect. Now, he's still living in uh, Hava de Grace? Yes. Right? He likes it there, I guess. That's close to a lot of stuff. You're close to Philly, close to Wilmington, you're close to here. Yeah. Hava de Grace, close to the water. Real estate's reasonable. Oh, in the side. Hallelujah, baby. Wow, Nine ball yeah. on the crack. Take away that easy street. we got to reverse it. How do we reverse it? Street. He's not on it. Not so. Not so easy street. we got to do one. I told you guys. Yeah. You're right. He was... 
Six four? And he had to, he had to catch six a couple rolls. There's one of them rolls, you know? It's six to four. Mercy. No. Who would you rather play right now by what you're saying? Doesn't matter, does it? I don't matter. I mean, they both play good. Either way, you're going to have to play my game. You might game. go softer on Wilkie, like though, I'm wouldn't you? Wouldn't you play like a little I'm softer on Wilkie? Because you guys are No, he plays too buddies. good to go soft on. Next thing you know, you'll be buddies, behind on buddies, it. You're buddies, you know? All right. So it doesn't really matter. No. You're just going to play the one. Who cares? As long as you go to no. New York City Thanks. for that concert with Kenny Chesney, you're good to go. <laughs> I told Matt, if you don't take it, I will. See that? She said, no problemo. <laughs> <laughs> and then we'll catch up with you up in New York at the tournament. The other tournament. He made something. He did. He did not make something. It's not a roll. Well, we're not going. Ryan's not supposed to get two rolls in one weekend. He got one roll earlier today. Six to four. He's got to win this game or he's in trouble. He's got to, he got to win every game. They both game are in trouble. Here. I mean, this could be a... Well, I think Wilkie's walking around like he feels like he can well, he gets it to get six, right back in it. He, he knows he can... Six, five. Yeah, he knows he can put two together easy. <laughs> we got a little bit at stake. We got... You got a little bit at stake. That mic taker. He'll spend money and you'll make money. <laughs> uh, that's not a bad idea. That's right. Did you read that? Test dummy. You know Test dummy? That email name? Do you um, know who that person is? Uh, no. Okay. Who Test dummy? Who? That's just who, is, who is Test dummy? Now I'm trying to figure out. I don't know. He knows both of us, but I, I can't figure out which. Well. It. He left him, let him see it, but And uh, the online chat now. <laughs> oh, I love that. Mom's chat. She's watching you live. All right. Nice. Got another fan for He's the He's been finals. a good boy all weekend, Mom. I got to tell you. <laughs> good boy. Like a gentleman. I think if Sean makes his ball, I agree with uh, uh, Curly Fry that Wilkie's out. The eight nines kind of nasty. You're right. Eight I can't nine's tell a if he can if, it, if he can throw the combo. I think from here he's gonna have to break it out, right? Yeah, he's got to break it out. It's on it. So I mean, he doesn't really have no, you're a, right a good that. breakout to it. Till, the seven's till way the seven. That's here. the breakout. Because I mean, unless he does it with the four. Yeah, but he if he does it with the four, then he's gonna have to try to play shape off the breakout for the five. I, I think he's got a problem with the eight nine. Big problem. You know, unless he rolls it around the table, well, with the five, I don't know. I think he'll try to break it out with the seven. And worst comes to worst, if you uh, if you don't break it out with the seven, then you can just kind of skim it and play it safe. Yeah. I mean, if he goes out and hits the five right, he might be able. To no, he's not doing that. We're off the point. See, this could be a, a break, but the end, the cue ball's out of control. You hate to lose the cue ball. I think on the women's side, Malia Hack just just got knocked out. She ended up three four. Malia Hack. Get that good. Got we'll perfect. give you some women's uh, results here soon. 
Not perfect, but he's pretty good. I don't expect him to make this. I just gotta make sure he comes up with some kind of angle on the seven to give himself a chance at breaking out that eight nine. This is tough from here. I don't know how he's gonna do it. I mean, he's gonna draw it over. He's gonna have to. It's almost like playing it. straight pool. You gotta get the angle. He to came up break short. Out. See now. He can't break it from there. I don't think. He's in trouble here. I think he's gonna have to figure out a way to play safe. But I don't know. There's no point in making the seven because you ain't got a shot at the eight, right? Unless he cuts it backwards, which I don't think he's going to do. If he cuts it backwards, he could break the balls out. You know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, that's he's, a he's got a brutal a, shot. Well, someone's going to guys someone's gonna have to break out that eight nine. It doesn't go anywhere. Yeah. Brian's on the hill. If he if he misses the cut and breaks it out, the ball game's over. You got to go safe, I think, especially when the guy's on the hill. No, I like pl I like putting the seven down near that right now and playing safe and making Ryan. You know, playing break, safe right break, now, playing right? Safe yeah, and break I would it play out. safe now too. I think. And he cut it backwards for the breakout. Yeah, see, like I you said, I don't, I don't like, like it either. He made a good effort. He tried to break it you out. What? He can still play safe here. He can play safe, but you know, I think he's an underdog from here. Big time. I mean, he's got to cross it now. It, there's no easy safe. I mean, you can't even skim it, or you're going in for the scratch. There. Well, he can leave it up here and leave it down there, and still, you know, one, two, three, four. Rail, leave the eight here if he can swing it. Maybe, right? They say you're going to kick bank the nine. No, the, you can't kick if it doesn't go. Or he could slice it into a Kick the back the nine and you lose the game from here. It doesn't, um, no. he can't throw it right. It's not even lined he up. He doesn't know what right. to do. He just looked in the air like, what What am I going to do? Yeah. What am I going to do with this? He got no, he's got nothing yeah, he's happy like with. That. I like that shot that um, pool player, pro pool player is talking about. Just kick it real soft. Take the scratch, somebody says. What, That's a good what? shot, too, actually. Take the scratch, go on one. No, why would you Well, if you, you kick that? it soft, the problem is, yeah, if you kick it soft, you can, and you bump it enough, you can leave him straight in on that 8 9. He could just slow roll it and drive the 8 to the rail and leave it there. He, that actually. That's not a bad move. Oh, he hit it too hard. Well, that's not shot. bad. Look at that. It's decent. That Ryan, has a, Ryan will have a safe here, but that's about put it. Put it far enough ahead that he can't bank it one rail. Although, can he bank this? Do we think he can bank this one rail? That was a real good shot. Uh, no, I don't think he can bank it. He's going to have to really shorten it up if he does. Th that's a pretty pretty, pretty good leave, in my opinion. I like banking that eight to the bottom rail. Leaving Sean a long bank, you know. Ain't nobody on Easy Street right now. Nobody. You know, that's very bankable, Matt. I just took a close look at it. That's not, that's very bankable one rail on the side. So he might make that. But he's probably playing safe. He's playing safe. It's a good move. One rail in the corner. Not a good shot. Uh, that was him. not a good idea. Look, he's taking a bathroom break here. He's got to come back and Time for the five juice minute. this ball and draw it all the way back. Yeah, this is, uh, he's got a choice straight in the hole. Yeah. It's the only thing you can do with it. If he misses, it's over. This turned out to be a very interesting semifinal match, you know. We thought it was running away, and it ran right back. Yeah. Right. Nice. Yep. Ryan McCreese is on the hill leading 6-4. Oh, thanks, Tess Dummy. Sean's at the table. Taking a break. Oh, look at that. Matt, good luck in the finals. You're a class act. Gracious. My God. wonder who that is. That's not... He, oh, stop it. Well, we'll leave it at that. Well, they're on break. We got that new banner flashing in the background. Good time to talk about the sponsors again. We got some sponsors. We got the sponsor, the Planet Pool Tour, Remax.
Pete Boyer, Coins of the Realm, great sponsor. George Hammerbacker, just came on a sponsor this year. Capone Cues, Remax, Jab Productions, The Mez Tour, Jose Borges, Gambling Clothing Line, good sponsors. I want to thank again Mike and Carl from Top Hat Pool here, Top Hat Billiards in Parkville, Maryland. This is the second event they've done this year for us, 2000 added, and they're going to do one more later in the year. Three events, Top Hat. Right here. All right. Wilkie's back. Oh, he's back. All right. Uh, shoot this ball. You know what? You can wipe it down, put the glove on. No, you talk about a betting man. If I was a betting man, I would bet he fires us in and comes back. I'll bet you he does, too. He's going to have to come back at four. He can stop right here and still get out. I, you know? I think he'll come all the way back. Almost. I don't think he's going to He's come got a good far. stroke, and he hits really? this ball good a lot. I, he doesn't have a lot of room off the rail, though, so he's going to have a short, short stroke from the rail. He's got a short stroke from the rail. He's going to be... Jacked up a little bit. Yeah. So it's uh, I'll tell you one thing. not an easy one to bring back without bobbling it in the pocketto. So I think he's going to hit it just soft enough to bring it back three or four feet. You know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, as long as you get beyond, if you clear the side pocket and get beyond there, yeah. that's, I mean, that's three good enough. Feet. Yeah. But. Because if you hit it hard, you're going to bobble but that see, puppy. This table with the, the heat on the, the cloth and all the lights, it takes draw real hard. Balls are sucking back quick. So if he hits it with any kind of power or draw, that ball's going to shoot back. Okay, but what if he doesn't hit it dead center in the hole? We got a lot of bobble room, right? Well, if he doesn't hit it dead center in the hole and he draws it too much, he could draw it back into that corner and scratch. If he, if he. What I'm saying is, if, if, he, if he hits it too it. hard, he's got a chance of bobbling it. That's yeah. My, my, that's my concern. Bobble, yeah. I'd rather be right there or back just two or three feet, four feet, whatever, without having it crack it too hard. If he hits it too hard, it's a good chance of bobble. And the bridge he's got to use, he's pretty close to the rail. He doesn't have a... He's going to have to jack up, I think. Or sort of. It looks like more distance than it really is, I think. He's going to have to short stroke it. We'll see. It's kind of hard to follow through with that short stroke, you know what I mean? We'll see. That's why he's taking so long. Here we go. Let's see what he does. I just don't like the fact that you got to hit it real hard and then bring it back and it's straight in the cup. Yeah. It makes it real, real tough. Road Dog Stevie said the same thing. He'd shoot if the other guy wasn't on the hill. If you're up like 6-2 to two or something, you know, this is a good shot. But I, Let's I mean, see. Bobble. See the bobble? See. That's what I meant. The bobble, baby. And he kisses and it's over. But, oh, no, you got a break. Uh, he got away with it. I mean, a Ryan's got Ryan's got to come with a shot now. Brian's got a shot. i got to go around the world, but that's all. He can go around the world. Yeah. He'll cut it backwards. That's the same. Was he yeah, he might have. He'll end up right on the middle dot on the on this back rail if he hits it perfect. I think he makes this with no problemo. No problemo at all. All that green straight in the hole and have to bring it back is tough. Yeah. No, he's making He's going to cut it in and go around the table. And, oh, no, he's going the other way with it. No, he's got to be cutting it in. Wouldn't you have to cut that ball in the... Right in the corner. On the low rail. Right here. He's playing. He's nervous. He don't, he don't want it. He's afraid to miss. I bet you. You think? No, he's cutting it. There he goes. He's going to use the inside, though. I think he's trying to figure out what English to use. I think you almost, if he uses the inside, what would you use here, Matt? Middle, inside, outside, if you're cutting it backwards? Um, you almost got to use, use, use a little left. bit of inside. The inside? To go, yeah, you go two rails and hit the short, you know, that short, that short rail, then the end rail, and then come up, but... I, you use inside, you're going to end up on the short side for shape, though. If you use outside... I mean, if you're real uncomfortable cutting this ball, Is he using can... inside? Can we tell? Middle, or he can't be using... Perfect. Oh. Wow. A little hard. A little freaking... Oh, boy. See, you know, he's I, still got a shot. He, he got this. He got a chance. He, yeah, I expect him to shoot He'll this nine. This. Yeah, go that for it. That's a tough yeah. shot, though. Look at the angle on it. Yeah, but Look you know up, what? Look up here, it's like... That's a lot better than being in that side pocket. This angle looks nice got. compared to what it does when you're on the real table. Look, 
He didn't hit that eight too great, uh, I don't, the I control think, like I cue ball. So where he's at now, I mean, I think he'll take it. He's going to play safe. I no, bet you he no, plays safe. he's cutting it in. He's clear. No, he's wiping the table to make sure it doesn't roll out or anything. Yeah. All right. Oh, he's definitely shooting. That's a tough angle. I got to tell you something. I don't like the shot. I, I, I don't think it's a high percentage make. I don't like it. I hope he knows where to leave the cue ball in case he misses. You know what I mean? Well, you don't think about. It. He's going to be thinking about that. With he's going to be you using just try to make it You don't really worry about. You don't really worry about uh, if you miss on this one. This is one you're just shooting to make. Yeah, but it's a tough shot. It's not a high. It's not. It's not a high percent well, shot. That's tough. That's a sharp angle. We'll see what he does. But I got news for you. I, I don't like. Yeah. That's a tough angle. I, I, I'm a betting man. I'm gonna tell you. I don't. I don't. I don't think he makes it. I don't think he makes it. He's thinking now. Should I'm I shooting. really play safe? Maybe? I'm shooting this ball. I'm cutting it. I feel it. Like. It looks easier there. I'm telling you right now, that's not that's a tough shot. <clears throat> Let's see what he does. This is for the match here. If he can make it, he, he, he gets game seven, closes the match out. Otherwise, we continue. Wow, what I tell you, Matt? He hit it bad. I told you I didn't like it. I don't shot. know. Watch it. It's a Wait. hard shot, man. Yeah. That was a hard shot. The TV, this view, this screen is very, it's misleading a lot of times on what really is out there. I got up and took a look at the angle at the table, and that was a tough shot. You know, that was not easy. So, now, how many bets in my head? Three or four? Hey, Matt, I, you liked yeah. that shot, didn't you? He liked that, does he? He liked that shot. I didn't like it. This is why. Now we got a 6-5 match. Anybody can win this. You know, Sean could go two and out here, and the match is over. You want the odds on that now? You like? Did you like that? Hey, uh, Alvin, did you like that nine ball shot? Did you think it was in? I would have. I would have. Very. I would have definitely played safe. I would have. That's why I'm behind the booth and they're on the table. But he did shoot and it cost him the game. Now, if you ask him now, he'll say, I should have played safe. It wasn't a high percentage shot. No, I don't think it was makeable, high percentage. Low percentage. No, I, that, that shot's actually easier on this table because the pockets are playing a little bigger because the way the lights are, it's, it's sucking it up a little more. Out out here, it's playing tighter. Out there, I wouldn't have shot. In here, I would have tried probably shot that. Um, in general, at TV table, you mean? Yeah. Um, no, nah, I mean you try to block that out and just play the way you would normally play. You got to get on them a few times to get comfortable. Yeah. Like somebody I mean, jumps on the first time, they're very uncomfortable. Yeah. I mean, they're they're nervous. Up. They don't know the heat. You sweat. People well, watching. Changing, people uh, moving. Look, he's changing his break again. He's kind of. No, he made a ball. He made one. And he's got a shot on the one. He made one. He made one. He's got a shot. And he's got an open rack. Six, six seven. Six. Uh, I like Sean three, from here in this rack. Three six combo is the only thing. And he's I think you know if Ryan doesn't lose his composure here and get to the table again, he's got a chance. But you know, you know how guys get when they stuff like this happens. You got to regroup. Well. Wow. He, uh, like he missed that, but he, he got it off the third. Well, he knew that, too, was there. Yeah, it was he a big knew he pocket. had help. If you know the help is there, you, just, you can miss like that.
He's already figured he's at the set six. Was that the three down there? What was that? Okay, that's a three six. So the three is next. He's going to have to play the combination on the six after he makes this. But I think it's straight in the cup. I don't see any problem here. If he gets to that three six. Is that Megan? With position on the three. <laughs> I was wondering who told me earlier that when oh, nine sorry. in the break wasn't a good roll. That was a nice hit. <laughs> Angle's a little tough. A little strange angle here to get position, but I think it'll be all right. I think he's out. I think we go hill-hill. My, my guess is we go hill-hill, and then uh, Ryan will take – well, Ryan can't take a break because it won't be on his turn. There won't be any break on the hill. Sean, uh, Sean's already taken his break. So we'll see what happens. Oh my goodness, look at that. He made a oh my god, it's gonna hit. Yeah, he hit that sporty uncomfortably, didn't he? And I think he thinks he's gonna win this match. I think Wilkie thinks he's gonna win the match now. I think he's the favorite from here he is for now. sure. He's definitely coming the back from that. He's got all the momentum, right? He's got the momentum, he's at the table. We were singing Easy Street three racks ago. What were, what were we thinking about? What were we thinking about? He's on Easy Street. Oh, no, he, not, he didn't go for it. He didn't roll it. He came up He's short. He's in trouble. He's going to have to cut that in the corner. He's got to cut that in the corner, doesn't he? No, he can go inside. He can go inside. See, it looks like easier up there. You see that? When you get up and look, it's, it's much more cuttable when you're up. I think he's going to go in the side. Forgot to hit it. Uh, not enough. Not enough juice. He held it up. That's mm, that's the match, guys. That's the end of that match. Good night, Irene. You know what Dandy Don used to say? Remember Dandy Don on Monday Night Football in the old days with Howard Cosell, Frank Gifford, and Dandy Don? When it was over and obviously over, right? Dandy Don would say, "Turn out the lights. The party's over. They say that all good things must end." Party's over, folks. Good luck, man. Ryan and right, uh, Matt Crawl in the final. Uh, Ryan's going to have to beat Matt twice, so it'll be a race to nine in the first match. If Ryan wins, it'll be a race to seven in the second match. All right. Thanks a lot, everybody. Well, it's nice having Matt Crawl in the booth with us. We had a good time. Now he's got to get down to business and go win a match, right, Matt? I'm going to try. All right, bro. Good All luck. Right. I'll see you guys soon. All right. Well, that was a good match. Going from singing Easy Street to Hard Times Cafe. Come on! <laughs>